everyone. Thank you very much for your interest. Hope you have all had a good summer. I'm very happy to be filming today from our new office in Valencia. Today I will be covering a quite interesting topic, uh, interesting for our clients that ask it quite a bit. Uh, what is it? The question is how do I mitigate the risk of having a local partner that owns 51% of my shares in the company that I set up. Why is that? Well, when we set up onshore in any Emirate in the, in the UAE, Dubai, Abu Dhabi, Ras Al Haima, the seven that we have, uh, you will need to you will need to, to you will need to have a local partner, and that local partner will need to have a 51% share right on your company. Um, this it's not a major, a major risk because there are ways to mitigate it. How do you do that? Well, you can do that already in the, in the Articles of Incorporation um, and the Memorandum of Constitution when you set up the company by reducing the economic rights of the partner from 51% to 20%. What else can you do? You can sign a proper trust or nominee agreement showing who is the owner and why is the owner and more important, saying that the local partner will transfer the shares to whoever that you designate, right? There are ways to do this document to ensure that it's legal. Uh, what else can you do? You can do a power of attorney uh, from the local partner to the investor, or uh, of course, you can imagine many uh, local partners do not want to do that direct power of attorney uh, to the investor. So something that works quite well is to do that power of attorney uh, to a lawyer or a consultant or someone who is in the middle who will receive instructions from both sides. Uh, what else can you do? You can have meetings, uh, ideally twice a year, uh, to keep the local partner alive. You don't want to kill the local partner. You don't want to keep him silent. Why do we say silent? Because uh, the practice used to be that you would silent the local partner. They would sign a document saying, hey, I, I, I am the nominee for the 51%, but I have no rights or obligations. And they would pay a, a little fee at the end of the year and nothing else. Well, uh, local courts, what they will do, if you have a, prob a problem with that local partner, is that they will break that piece of paper, and then they will ask you, what else do you have? So you need to ensure that the, the scheme is, 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 is correct, that you keep him alive, and, 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 and twice a year he comes to meetings, at least on paper, and you can show that he's uh, participating in the decisions, right? So if uh, a local partner goes crazy, yeah, he can go crazy, crazy once, but if you are able to show to the, to the court that he came and he participated and he agreed year after year, that's going to prevail. And this is in line with Dubai court and UAE court's jurisprudence. So no risk, but do it properly, do it right. Hope this is of assistance. Of course, there are other ways to, to mitigate on case by case basis, and we'll be very, very happy to, to assist having significant experience. So get in touch, you have my contact details. Thank you very much.